Bringing up Bates star Katie Bates Clark is sharing a new health update. Unfortunately, she's run into some medical issues. She took to social media to update her followers on the latest developments. So is she okay? What is the problem? Keep reading for all of the details. Bringing up Bates fans enjoy getting a glimpse into Katie's life. On social media, Katie is often bringing fans into her everyday life. She shares frequent updates about herself, her husband Travis Clark, and their daughter Haley. She tends to keep things positive, sharing the happy moments of motherhood or documenting family vacations. Because bringing up Bates was canceled, fans enjoy seeing her sweet photos and weekly YouTube videos too. But she also doesn't shy away from posting the harder things, like sicknesses and sad times. Fans seem to appreciate the fact that she's keeping it real, and it's a good way to get prayers and support. Katie Bates Clark gives fans a health update. Her most recent update was a little more disappointing. Unfortunately, Katie has been dealing with kidney stones. Getting answers and making progress has been a slow process, which is frustrating. On her Instagram stories on Friday, she informed fans about how she spent her birthday, which was October 5. She didn't have the best day because she had to head to a urology appointment. She explained to Bringing Up Bates fans that she had a kidney stone in May. This past week, she went to a follow-up appointment to determine the next steps, which could include removal. Due to scheduling issues, this was the soonest she was able to get an appointment. The 23-year-old explained, They reviewed the initial CAT scan and found out I actually had several kidney stones, but two were significant in size. So the next step is an ultrasound, which will show which of the stones are still there. She added that the doctors want to avoid another TAT scan because of the radiation exposure. But now, there's a little bit of a wait before Katie Bates Clark can get in for the ultrasound. Finally, the Bringing Up Bates star added, didn't find out a ton of new information, but it's a step in the right direction. Finally, the Bringing Up Bates star added, didn't find out a ton of new information, but it's a step in the right direction. Finally, the Bringing Up Bait star added, didn't find out a ton of new information, but it's a step in the right direction. Hopefully, the 23-year-old will start feeling better soon. Fans are praying for her and are hoping to get another positive update soon. So, are you relieved to hear that Katie Bates Clark is making progress on her health issues? Did you know this was going on behind the scenes? Sound off in the comments section below. And come back to TV shows Ace for the latest bringing up Bates family. As of late, Jonna Duggar has been a frustrating topic for counting on fans. Presently, she's the only Duggar over the age of 21 that isn't in a relationship. According to Cheat Cheat, rumors have started to swirl around the fan base of the TLC family that may be dipping into the dating pool to find that special someone. Whether Jonna Duggar is even interested in dating and marrying a man is a highly debated question. Many counting on fans suspect one of the biggest reasons Jonna has not settled down with a man is because she is not interested in doing so. And this isn't because they believe she's happy being a single and independent woman. This is because they believe she isn't interested in men. In fact, they believe she's interested in being with women. The root of the lesbian rumors stem from her strong friendship with Laura Damacy. Some counting on fans insisted Jana Duggar spent more time with Laura than what was appropriate for best friends. These fans questioned if their relationship was something more. Unfortunately, Jana was quick to shut down these rumors. In fact, she asked Duggar fans to quit discussing the topic entirely. This, however, did not silence the rumors. In fact, it just caused some to believe it to be true. Many believe Jana is afraid to be honest with her family about her preferred dating partner. They believe she fears how her family would react. Jana, however, continues to maintain these are just rumors. Rumors she does not like. And she insists she is only interested in men. She just has not found the right man to settle down with just yet. 
Could she settle down with a familiar face that TLC fans would recognize? Rumors have also swirled that Jenna Duggar is courting bringing up Bates star Lawson Bates. Some of these rumors stemmed from how similar the Bates and the Duggars are. This includes their conservative religious beliefs. Moreover, Jenna and Lawson are friends. While these rumors do continue to swirl, Duggar has not done or said anything to suggest things between here and Bates were romantic, which is something many counting on fans have found to be disappointing. Jim Bob and Michelle want to see their daughter get married. Jim Bob and Michelle are no different than fans when it comes to their feelings about Jenna being single. Sources close to the family have claimed Jim Bob and Michelle are frustrated with waiting for their daughter to find the right man. This isn't too much of a stretch to believe as the duo taught all of their children about starting a family. Despite feeling the pressure from both counting on fans and her family, Jana Duggar seems content to marching to her own drum as opposed to going down the traditional Duggar path. Do you think Jana Duggar could be lying about not being interested in women? Do you think Jana feels pressured to get married? Sound off in the comments down below. Carlin and Whitney Bates live with many siblings. In Whitney's case, she married Kelly Joe Bates' son Zach Bates. Currently pregnant, she thought about whether she'd end up giving birth to 19 kids like Kelly. Carlin also talked about it. So far, she only had one child with her husband, Evan Stewart, and poor little Layla suffered some health complications. Did that make her hesitant about having more kids? Carlin and Whitney Bates talk about many kids they want. Recent news gave Carlin some joy. It seems like Layla's on the mend. Recall, her arrival brought some stressful moments. The cute kid was born with a hole in the heart, and later, she experienced breathing and low oxygen problems. Avon and Carlin really went through a very worrying time, and at one stage, they both teared up as they described their fears. Now their daughter seems a lot better, will they plan for more kids? Carlin and Whitney Bates both opened up to US Weekly about future children. The Bringing Up Bates stars certainly like the idea of kids, but will they consider as many as 19? In their conversation with the two women, Erin Bates also spoke up. She predicted that Carlin might produce somewhere between 6 and 19 kids. Hmm. What do you think Carlin's reaction was? No specific number of kids decided yet. Evan's wife probably produces way less than 19 kids. While she said that she admired her mom as a great parent, she probably won't opt for so many children. She told the outlet, Right now, we're just so excited and cherish in every little moment with our 12-month-old daughter, Layla, but we'll see, who knows. However, she also noted that she doubted she'd go for 19 of them, but they seem keen on a few. Actually, both Carlin and Whitney Bates consider way fewer kids than the bringing up Bates matriarch. Meanwhile, Whitney already produced three kids and expects another baby but it looks like she and Zach draw the line at many more. She told the outlet that perhaps one more might suffice. The U. Pitfi family expands often, and Josie Bates expects her second baby in 2021. It seems that between Carlin and Whitney Bates and Josie, perhaps all three of them might jointly produce 19 kids. Of course, in time, Lawson might also produce some kids. Slow to marry, he officially dates Tiffany Espenson now. They became Instagram official this year, and fans seem very taken with the 22-year-old Tiffany. As Lawson nears the age of 30, fans hope he soon produces some kids of his own. As he grew up in the large Bates family, probably he also plans on a few kids. Potentially, like Carlin and Whitney Bates, he might not aim as high as 19.